this is going to be a hotel tour and review of the Ottawa Marriott Hotel in Ottawa, Ontario, Canada. See? Marriott. We are going to go inside and explore this hotel. See? Marriott. All right, let's enter the hotel. This hotel was built in 1972. It is 29 floors and it is the, currently the, the eighth tallest building in the city of Ottawa. <laughs> Anyways, let's go inside and tour this property. See if it's any good. All right, here's the entrance. Oh yeah, and by the way, that is, we went, by the way, down here is into the parking deck. This road goes into the underground parking deck. Anyway, let's now go inside and tour the hotel. So when you walk in, you are greeted with a pretty nice looking lobby with a front desk. Here's your front desk. You got some tourist stuff about Ottawa. And right here, you have um, your elevator bank over there. <laughs> and you either have to take a few steps or you have to take a little ramp up. And you got a sitting area right here with the TV. <laughs> and you got a dog right here. <laughs> Got more sitting area. And we got a business center right here with Windows PCs. And you got a restaurant here. Which we will take a quick look around it. Let's see. Here's a look at the restaurant. Not much. Mm -mm. Yeah, here's a look inside. Yeah. Mm -mm. So yeah, here's a look inside the big restaurant here. Now anyway, I'm gonna show you something interesting here. Here you got some bathrooms right here. And what is interesting is that they are located in between the, the, lobby, the main lobby floor and the lower lobby. See down there? And yeah, you'll see what I mean later on, but you might, unless you already get what I'm trying to say here, but anyway, 
Let's go back up. And let's continue on with the tour. And right here are your main elevators. There's another view of your business center. And right here you got a sitting area. You got a visitor Caius here. Here's another view of your front desk. You got a telephone here. And you have a little mini market here with some Gatorades and drinks, some desserts, some snacks, magazines. It's about really what there is here. So, and also there's a microwave here. And there are the two parking garage and conference center elevators. There are some bathrooms over here. And here is Starbucks, which is shut because of the time of day it is. But yeah, so here's, we gotta look around most of the first floor. We will go down and look. We are going to go downstairs and look at a parking floor. P4. All right. These are original Otis Lexan elevators. They serve the parking floors only. As you see, says here is a look at the parking deck not a whole lot to see here Let's see there it says hotel entrance That there are signs that direct you to the, direct you to the elevators. We're gonna go back up. Ugh. Let's go up. Oh, both of them came. Let's so look inside. See? 
here's a directory right here. You're going to go up to the executive level. Right here are mostly just offices, so yeah, can get a look around. It's empty and a lot of it's shut now. These are just offices. So it makes sense they'd be shut by now. <laughs> yeah, this is the executive level with all the offices and stuff. Nothing real special down here. Here's the service corridor. I'm not going to do any more wandering. I don't think I should really be here, so. Let's go up another floor. Oh, this one. Good to go to LL. Right here are mostly just ballrooms. Those are stairs behind there. You got bathrooms down here. Now we are by where the bathrooms are. Bathrooms are right by there, and above me is the lobby. And mostly right here, you just have a bunch of ballrooms here. And that goes down to the executive level. And you got a little wheelchair thingy, but I don't think it works and I'm not gonna mess with it. Here are your main elevators. And there's the ladies room. Oh, this is employees only.
Just some more ballrooms and stuff. It's not much to see here. We're going up. Let's go up to two. You're on two. All right. Right here, more ballrooms and bathrooms, all of that stuff. It's nighttime, so a lot of the stuff is shut down. Got a little eating area there and some coffee here. Yeah, this is all shut right now because of the time it is. When you got an ATM here. All right. Well, we explored just about everything down here. So we are going to take these elevators up. I'm getting one of you guys. go up to three. And here's the third floor. All oh, this empty ballroom space. Women. Let's look. Oh. Wellington. Yep, not much to see here.
And there's nothing else over here, so you know what? I'll go to the next floor we can go to. Go up to four. Anyways, we're gonna look here. Here's the pool. I'm not gonna go close into it because I don't wanna get anybody on camera more than I already have. And here is your fitness center. And there's people working out, so I'm not gonna get them. Let's see what's out here. Ooh, you got, and you got a nice little deck here. Wow. We are gonna go. All right. Doing good. Men's room. And over here is a kid's playroom with arcade games. You got a big arcade here. See all your video games. <laughs> Here are all the toys and whatnot for the little kids. And right here you have a 
two Xbox, two TVs and with two Xbox 360s. And back here is the laundry room. Oh, here we go. With an iron and your machines themselves. And right here, there's a spa, but it's shut. And right here is another playroom. In here, you've got some air hockey and see, look at that. And some board games. Here we've got like a little theater, I guess, is this is what's supposed to be. And a TV with a PlayStation 4. And yeah, another TV with another PlayStation 4. And right here, you have a little area where you can play hockey or throw some basketballs. And here's some air hockey and tennis. All right. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna pause here for now. All right, now we are done with the lower floors exploring the hotel. Now we will go up, hmm, it's a hospitality suite, Conica Minolta. Get the lantern. All right. We will go all the way up to 28. All right, let's look around up here. We're right below a revolving restaurant, which is sadly shut down right now. Get really good views of Ottawa from here. Locked. There's the lower floor. We'll go down those steps soon. Anyways, here's a little bit more of Ottawa. There's the Ottawa River, also known as the Quebec, Ontario state line. And there's the city of Gatineau, Quebec. Like I said, we're in Ottawa, Ontario.
can see the bridges and stuff. It's very beautiful out. You can see all of the parliament buildings and stuff. And somewhere you can see the... On uh, there you can see the Chateau Laurier Hotel. Let's go down the steps here. See so here you got like some meeting rooms of some sort. And steps. It's kind of empty down here. Feels really weird here. We've got bathrooms here. You have the narrow hallway. This door was open earlier. And you can see how they've shut the doors now, so I probably shouldn't be here, so let me head back to the elevators. Do 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 do. doesn't work because the revolving restaurant is shut twenty six and we will look here. Right here. Ways we're going to go inside the concierge lounge. So we are going to go inside. It's a view of your concierge level. This is a view of Ang. What a view. <laughs> As you see, there's a lot of spiders out. Thankfully, they're not in the building, and you got this little a bunch of bar seats here. And you got areas this here you'd get breakfast and some other stuff here during the day. And here are some areas you can sit. There's a TV. And right here you have a computer, a Windows 7 and a printer and right here you have a bathroom
This would be a tremendous failure for the company. See it. And as you see, you can see the same view we saw up higher, and you can see there's spiders everywhere. Thank God they aren't inside. Oh gosh, that'd be scary. Got books here. And here's some more sitting area here. This area is all dark, and right here you can get a straight view into Ottawa. Okay, I don't want to get too close. I know the spiders are not in the building, but ugh. Yeah. Anyway, I think we've toured most of the hotel, so let's head down to my room. Yeah, not much up on the hallways. So we are going to take the elevator down and we will I will show you my room. This is going to be a tour of my room at the Ottawa Marriott Hotel in Ottawa, Ontario, Canada. As you can see, we are in room 2321. So let's go inside and let me tour you around. Here we go. All right, you got your basic security features. You got your deadbolt and your latch lock here. So yeah, let's get a look at this room. Anyways, here's your, uh, I was touring the room and you just interrupted me. And Here's your um, rules and stuff for the um, hotel laws and stuff. So yeah. Here's a photo. And there is me in the mirror. Hi. So overall, here's a view of the room. Pretty basic room, as you can see. Here's our closet. There's a little small space to store your stuff. Here is the bathroom. As you see, the bathroom is extremely tiny but remember this is an older hotel it um it's it's not as old as the shadow champlain but um it is still an older hotel and 
it doesn't have the character the Champlain does, but it was built in 1970s too, and the room size and bathroom size are just typical from the year, okay, the year this place was built. So anyways, here's your sink. It's a Kohler sink. There's your toilet. I mean, there's your toilet paper. There's me in a mirror. Hi, and you got a light around the mirror. Hi. And right here, you got a commode right here, which is an American standard. I'm not going to bother flushing it, but there it is. Or I can just... Because I don't want to get spread germs and stuff, so I'll just flush it with my foot. We'll flush it. And here is your tub. And your shower. Kohler faucets. And overall, this bathroom appears to be in pretty good condition with a few exceptions like the crack there, a little bit peeling there, and also you can see there's a big scratch there, but other than that, it's in pretty good shape. Let's, we can shut it off if I know it can find where the switch is. Um... Great, I do not know where I turned it on. It's mystery, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, so here's the whole... Oh, there we go. It's on the outside. And here's a view of the room itself. There's me again. Hi. And here you have a LG flat screen TV. And you got... A in-room safe and a fridge. The thing is a bit scraped up. And over here you have um, some shelves which are clear from the last guest. And here is your coffee maker. There's a remote. And over here, like I said, yeah, you do have a tad bit of maintenance issues. Like you can see how how the how the ceiling isn't in the best of shape here, and it can kind of see a little bit of um not a whole lot. You can't really see it, but. There is a bit of maintenance issues here, but it's mostly good though. Here is your king-sized bed. Before we do that, here's your alarm clock. Nothing in here. And let's check your pillows to make sure they are clean. Pillows appear to be very clean, which is good. Yeah, overall the bed appears to be clean. And it feels reasonably comfortable. Not the best, but not even close to being the worst. It's overall pretty good. And here is your um, couch or, and with the sofa bed. Here's some stuff about Marriott and the some religious books and stuff and there's empty shelf and there's your phone see Marriott Ottawa And here's a table with an ice bucket, some waters, and some glasses. Here's Eddie the backpack. Hey! And here is a um, chair here. 
And over here is are some magazines um, about Ottawa and Marriott and stuff. And here's an empty shelf, a coffee maker, some outlets, and here is some coffee stuff and tea. There's a lamp right here. And here's your uh, um, desk with my stuff on it. <laughs> Another phone. Here's me. Hi. And right out here, you can get a, v a really good view here. Because I'm on the 23rd floor, so you can get really good views here. Anyways, he, we're in downtown Ottawa, Ontario. Here are some of the Parliament buildings. And Canada, all the Canada government buildings and stuff. You can see a little bit of downtown Ottawa. Not a whole lot, but you can see some. And right here is the Ottawa River, which is also the um, Ontario-Quebec boundary or border. There's a bridge and another bridge. And as you can see, the other city you're looking at across from the river, that is Gatineau, Quebec. Um, and yeah, Ottawa, and yeah, it borders with Quebec, like I said. But yeah, you can get a view into Gatineau and you can see that. Yeah, you can't see much of Ottawa, but overall the view is pretty nice from here. Um, but yeah, and there's another bridge. But yeah, anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed the tour of my room at the Ottawa Marriott Hotel. Anyways, I mean, I think this is a nice room. I mean, I love the view from here and stuff. It is a bit dated though. I mean, something being dated doesn't, um bother me as long as it's in good shape and stuff but there are a few maintenance issues here not horrible though but um but yeah I do think this room does kind of need to be updated but it's not bad though I mean but it does is kind of showing its age like it's apparently this place was renovated in 2009 and you can tell the lobby has been but the rooms Eh, they kind of scream the 80s or 90s. Definitely not 70s. They've been changed since, but they do still feel a bit dated, though. And not, like, charming kind of dated like the Shadow Champlain was. But overall, this is, looks like a pretty good tell. Um, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. I hope you enjoyed my tour of the Ottawa Marriott Hotel in Ottawa, Ontario, Canada. Thing. And with that being said, Floridian Elevators is now going to be signing off. So, bye-bye.